Hello, everybody, and welcome back to RL Craft. Um, in last episode, we spent a lot of time uh, building this expansion of the house. And as you can see, I put down some carpet. We do actually have some new items <clears throat> throughout our inventory here. Just a new iron lance. We got our summoning staff, and then I got some purified water. Um, I also went ahead and sorted all of the chests in the different categories. I'll just flash through them real quick here so that we know where things are. Okay, so first things first, let's go ahead and look at how to make an atlas. I do need to hurry up and make one of these. Um, I think it's this one that we need. It's a compass and a book and quill. Book and quill was made with a book, feather, and ink sack. Books are made with paper and leather. Okay, so we can actually make all of that. Uh, mob drop, or why is paper in mob drops? I don't know why that's in mob drops. Uh, my leather should be here. So paper and leather. Actually, uh, this is a squid. That kind of scared me for a second there. Uh, paper and a piece of leather to make a book. Plus that. Plus what else do I need? A feather. Okay. And that makes the book and quill, and then I see my compass to make the atlas. So, where's my feather? My feather should be in here. Okay. And then, feather, ink, and book makes a book and quill. And then if we take our compass from here, we can use our compass and our book to make an atlas. Cool. And now with our atlas, we can see where we are and nearby locations. Uh, I'm not sure how far out this actually goes, just off of generation. Um, but it looks as though it goes, you know, generally out to where we've been for the most part. Let's go ahead and sleep real quick and we'll actually test how far out this goes by heading out towards like the battle tower kind of area and see, you know, how far out does this really go? I think it only did our immediate area. <clears throat> I think we do have to explore to get the rest of it. But let's go ahead and take a look and just see if we can <clears throat> understand how far out it goes. So like right here, we'll start to see Yeah, it's like something that we could do. So we can add a marker right here. Type being, we'll just make it an X because we've finished that tower. Um, okay, so something I would like to do in this episode probably is actually exploring this dungeon a little more that we have. I think it's over here. Yeah, this dungeon. I want to explore this a little bit more. I don't really feel like we've given it enough attention yet. So let's go ahead and set this marker to that. So that we'll know it is here. Is there a smaller one? Oh, hey, okay. What we can do is we can delete that marker, add this, and this is going to be um, Spiral Dungeon. Since we know it's a spiral. <clears throat> type of dungeon, and we'll just add a, yeah, we'll just use a skull marker, and then we can delete this marker and add a new one back in over there, and call this finished BT for battle tower. Cool, so now we know what that is, in village there, we'll add a marker, this is home, and we'll mark that with a house icon. It was already marked, but, you know, that's okay. Okay, so let's actually head back to the house and go get our preparations for um, that. Something that I have noticed that people say that I should be making is a disenchanting table, so we'll take a look at how to make it that. Um, but right now, priority is definitely going to be getting home, getting some materials, and some preparation for a dungeon adventure, but we'll take a look at how to make a disenchanting table while we're there. 
I think it's going to be relatively the same materials as an enchanting table, which I currently don't have the resources to make. But, well, I might. <clears throat> I have some obsidian. So let's see, what does it take to make a disenchanting table? Disenchant. Uh, 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 automatic bulk disenchanting voiding. Okay, so to make one we need three emeralds, an enchantment table, and two dyes. And also magic 20. Do we need to make that again? Book, four obsidian, two diamonds. Okay, well, we definitely have the diamonds for that, but we, I don't think we have the other things. So, we'll just go ahead and get some food here. Uh, store away our food. Go and put everything in the sorted chests. Uh, da -da -da. Back to animal drops. Put these in. String can go back in here. And then we just have some <clears throat> miscellaneous, which just kind of gets thrown in here for now. Uh, sticks actually go in the this chest. Okay. Okay, so let's take a look here. We have diamond everything except for the chest plate. Why are we not wearing an iron, a diamond chest plate? Um, yeah, let's take this one. So let's we'll go ahead and pop that on, <clears throat> put the iron away. We do have a summoning staff on us. Uh, I would like to take maybe a bow um, and a rapier instead of, or no, the halberd. Well, actually, yeah, we'll, we'll take the rapier instead. Um, just so that we can use it for, uh, we can use a shield, so we can take this shield and actually put it in our offhand, and then now we have a shield to use. Um, obviously that works great with the bow. Wait, 38. 39, okay. I was wondering for a second there if we could duplicate arrows with multi-shot, um, but it looks like we can't, which... I mean, fair enough, I didn't really expect us to be able to. Let's see, I don't think I have a slot for this. No, I do not. Okay. That's okay, though. I don't really need a slot for that. Uh, diamond sword we can't wield yet. I think we'll be okay with these weapons. Maybe grab a halberd for reach. I don't feel like we need it, though. Hmm. Ugh, excuse me, guys. I'm recording this very, at a very awkward time for myself. Uh, usually I would be asleep around now, but we're having nachos for dinner, and I'm actually super excited for that because I love nachos. So, hence why I'm not sleeping yet, even though I am dead tired. Like, I am extremely tired. Uh, okay, we're gonna go ahead and make some more torches, I believe, because I don't think we actually have any laying around. Yeah, no, we don't. Okay, so we're gonna take the coal out of these three furnaces. We're gonna use that coal to make torches. I uh, probably didn't need that many torches, but that's okay, because we'll store some more of them in there. Alright, and that should be good enough for us to go off and adventure a little bit. Just make sure we're not taking anything else unnecessary with us. Uh, maybe leave two water bottles here. <clears throat> I don't think the water bottles will be super, super, super necessary. And uh, did I leave the atlas behind? Yes. Is it in the miscellaneous? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, I should probably put this in, like, that chest. <laughs> Okay, so let's go ahead and have a gander on down. Oh, uh -huh. I knew I was forgetting something. Bandaging. We need bandages. Luckily, we have bandages in this chest here. So we'll go ahead and get both of those. We don't really need water on the hot bar. We can move it when it becomes necessary. But same thing with food. We don't really need food on the hot bar. 
Okay, make sure our summons are set to Jabberwocks on aggressive follow. Cool. So now we should be set for that dungeon. Um, hopefully we'll be able to make our way through it. Without too many deaths. <clears throat> uh, from what I read, there's usually a lot of good, um, good loot in these places, in this specifically, this type of dungeon. Also, I don't know why it's so laggy here every time, but, um, okay, so let's go ahead and use the waterfall. I gotta remember to be careful, we still have to be cautious of things like this. You know, darklings are still dangerous, no matter how many we've killed. Yep. I heard you coming. I heard the pitter-patter of his feet. There's a darkling here, I believe. Somewhere down in there. Okay, let's get some chupacabras spawned. Start lighting the areas up as we venture into them. Sorry again, I know I'm, I kind of really suck at commentating during dungeons. I get really focused when I'm in here. Um, but I am going to try to improve that. I know it's probably really annoying for you guys. Luckily, okay, my Jabberwocks are following like they're supposed to. So that's good. I should probably keep a weapon out when I'm moving into tunnels like this. Okay, we have a spawner up ahead. Do have a spawner zombies? Okay, let's go ahead and refresh our Jabberwocks. Since they will become very useful in this room. Or not, because nothing's going to spawn. Okay, that's neat. Um, go ahead and loot up real quick. What do we get? Two tempered blades. Sharpness unbreaking mending. What does mending do? Hmm. We'll have to research that. Um, get some carrots and some wheat. Uh, that's always nice to get. Let's go ahead and resummon again. Can never be too safe with your summons. Okay. So. Let's just take a quick little look down here. I hear a darkling. Okay, there's a zombie. Zombies are super basic, even still. Okay, I hear a spider for sure, but I want to grab this iron. Yes, yeah, Jabberwocks, I know. You guys are thirsty for blood. You'll get your chance, don't worry. I will definitely let you guys run free on some enemies. You are set to aggressive, so you guys will be able to kill. Um... Okay, let's try opening this up a little bit. See if we can't get in here without it being a total pain in the ass. There is a spider right there. Okay, there's now a dead spider there. Always keep an eye out behind us. Send some more travel locks. Really too keen on venturing into the darkness. Hmm. Okay. Let's go ahead and light this way up. Okay, it all looks good on that side. Um, I do want some Jabberwocks though for this. This looks scary. This looks like a trap.
That is a very interesting, uh... It's like a ravine here. Oh, there's a chute. Okay. Let's head this way. Oh god. Nope. Why do my Jabberwocks just do nothing there? Okay, there we go. that hallway for what it was worth. Cool. Another spider spawner. Always good to get rid of spawners. And you, you can never be too paranoid either. Like, every sound I'm hearing I'm wanting to react to, and it's... You know, it puts me very on edge, but you can never be too careful. Should have brought a blunt weapon as well, just for the case of those. The case of armored enemies, that is. What the heck? He just wasn't getting damaged anymore. space we are that's just some lapis Okay, we're actually out of... We need to go back, because we need more... Uh, I don't want to do this with my matchbox not existing anymore. Go ahead and break this jukebox, though. I guess we'll take it home. Um, okay. I know this isn't the way out. Oh, well. Maybe it is. No harm in looking, I guess. Wait, that's the cake. I recognize that cake. Yeah, I've been here. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't want to have to fight my way out of here. So, uh... Sorry, jukebox, but you're getting left behind. Try this again. Sorry, jukebox. It's getting left, but sorry, jukebox. But you're getting left behind. Okay, I'm over it. Okay, so, relatively successful. I didn't really get a whole lot um, out of that trip, but that's mostly due to just the fact that our matchbox uh, ran out. Um, 
Okay, and now to make the nighttime sprint home. Also, level 22, that's pretty nice. Uh, let's go ahead and get the wood. It's in the common box. Uh, oh boy. Do not have enough. We do not. Okay, that's okay though. Um, what I can do actually is I'll just use this chest for right now. And we'll base this one as stuff that we've gotten today. Um, okay, so 20 normal torches. I'm actually really happy with that. Uh, we do need those. Go ahead and put those away. Let's swap out. Uh, where is my water sitting? Ah, uh, the front chest, right. Let's go ahead and put those two bottles away and grab two new ones. <clears throat> okay. So, what's next on the list of what we need to get done to go down in there again? Um, we could use a matchbox. Okay, let's actually put those away. Uh, how do we make a matchbox? Let's find that out. Matchbox. I forgot how... Paper and slabs. To make slabs, we need three planks. Uh, okay, so we don't actually have the ability to make that right now. Um, because I don't have enough wood in order to make wood slabs. But, fear not. Uh, we can probably make do with the tor normal torches that we have. So we're going to go ahead and we'll head back down there and take a look. We need to bring more food. I forgot to grab more food. But let's go ahead and grab some food, and then we'll head back down. We'll take the cooked squid this time. Uh, and again, the stuff doesn't need to stay out. Did I put bread in here? By accident? I did. Okay, so we'll just take half the cooked squid. And actually, let's, uh... Let's dump our XP into some things. Um... Okay, I do want to get everything to level 8, at least, so let's get this up. Okay, and next, I think we'll do attack, so we can start to use more, uh... What's it called? So we can use more diamond tools and things of the sort, and like, you know, things like endermium, eventually. Um, but yeah, so how have you guys been? You guys been enjoying the series? I really hope so. Um, I've been putting a lot of time into this series, and I mean a lot. Like, I'm recording every other day in sessions, and then I'm uploading, you know, however many times I can within a couple of days' time. You know, I'm uploading extremely often. Um... Well, I'm uploading daily, but that's, you know, I, I was having some long way of saying I upload daily. Um, but yeah, I mean, I do all that for you guys, you know. I enjoy the game, for sure, but definitely my motivation to keep uploading is, you know, the viewers. You know, I, I need you guys, so... Been getting a couple comments here and there, and it's you know it brightens up my day. I like seeing comments from you guys and tell me what you like and what you don't like in the series and things like that. Um, so you know, comments and things of the sort are always going to be welcomed by me. I'm never going to have a problem with you guys giving me comments. Um, okay, so real quick, let's summon some Aegis into the room. Oh boy, I'm really sorry about that. I don't know what the heck was happening there. But summon my Aegis while I get some more iron. Uh, we can never have enough iron, you know. We need quite a lot of that stuff. Okay, so now... What the fuck 